case, so properties of probability distribution. So these are the properties of this probability distribution. So we have this the first one, that all probability is greater than or equal to 0 but less than 1. Now since greater than 0, so therefore all positive. Then for the second one, the summation of the probabilities is equal to 1 or the sum of all the probabilities is equal to 1. So these are the two properties of this probability distribution. Then we have this given, so identify if the given is a probability distribution or not. So for A, uh, we're going to add all these probabilities and it should be equal to 1. So using the properties that the summation of all probabilities is equal to 1. Then using calculator, so 0.16 plus 0.25 plus 0.19 plus 0.29, plus 0.06. So since the sum is not equal to 1, so therefore this given is not a probability distribution. Then for B, so add these uh, fractions. So that's 2, A, B, C, 17. So this is how to uh, add fractions. So using this uh, function, the A, B, C, so 2 ABC 17, that's 2 over 17, plus 3, then ABC 17, plus then 5, this ABC 17, that's 5 over 17, then plus 3, then ABC 17, then plus 4, then ABC 17. So that's equal to 1. Now since the sum is equal to 1, so therefore this given is a probability distribution. Then for this problem, so solve for k, so add all the probabilities and equate to 1. So we have um, 0 0.21, then plus k, then plus 0 0.24, then plus 0 0.21, and that's equal to 1. Then simplify, so combine like terms, so that's 0.21 plus 0.24, that's 0.45 plus 0.21, so that's 0 0.66. Then plus k, that's equal to 1. Then to solve for k, so transpose this 0 0.66 to the right, so that becomes negative, so 1 minus 0 0.66. So therefore, k now is equal to 0 0.66. 34. So this is now the value of k. Then for this given, so add all these probabilities, then equate to 1. So 1 over 16 plus 2 over 16, then plus 6 over 16, plus 5 over 16, plus k, then plus 1 over 16, and that's equal to 1. Then combine like terms. Now since the same denominator, so just copy this denominator and add a numerator. So 1 plus 2 plus 6, that's 9, plus 5, 14, plus 1, that's 15, then plus k equals 1. Then transpose. So k now, that's 1 minus 15 over 16. Then we can rewrite this 1 as 16 over 16 because the denominator is 16 to make the two fraction equal denominator so 15 over 16 so therefore k is 1 over 16 so this is now the value of k then for this given solve for k so add all these probabilities then equate to 1 so k plus 2k then plus 2k, plus 3k, plus uh, k squared, plus 2k squared, plus uh, 7k squared, plus k, then equals 1. Then combine like terms, so combine all k and combine all k squared. So for k, this one is 1, plus 2, that's uh, 
3 plus 2, 5, plus 3, that's 8, and plus 1, that's 9. So we have 9k plus the k squared. So we have 1 plus 2, that's 3, plus 7. So we have 10 k squared, then that's equal to 1. Now, since this one is a quadratic equation, so equate to 0 and arrange this equation. So starts from the highest exponent plus 9k, then transpose this one becomes negative and that's 0. Then we're going to apply a factoring. So this trial and error factoring. Then uh, factors for 10k, that's 10k times k. Then factors for 1, we have 1 and 1. Then to check the signs, so we're going to use this pyramid multiplication. So 1 times k, this one is k, then 10k times 1, that's 10k. Now since the middle term is 9k or positive 9k, so therefore this k is negative and 10k is positive. So the factors now, so 10k minus 1 and k plus 1. Then to solve for k, so these are the factors, 10k minus 1, we have k plus 1, that's equal to 0. So equate the two factors to 0, so we have 10k minus 1 equals 0, then the other one, k plus 1 equals 0. Then to solve for k, so transpose, so we have now 10k equals positive 1, divide by 10, divide by 10. So therefore, k is 1 over 10. And the other one, transpose, k is negative 1. Now since one property of the probability distribution, the probability is greater than 0. Since greater than 0, therefore, always positive. So this is now the value for k. And this k negative 1, is not the value of k because 1 is negative.